Yes, sir. What's good, YouTube? What's good, Master Tree? It's your boy, Pro Jamaica, man. Back live in the flesh, man. I ain't gonna care. People said they like Pro Jamaica more than Up Top Dan. So I was like, you know what? Let me just be a man of the people real quick. Switch back to Pro Jamaica. And here we are. You know what I'm saying? So now all the people, you know what I'm saying, that love to call your boy Pro Jamaica, y'all can do it again. But uh, yeah. Today's video is on a request that a lot of people have been making and the request is how to map um, controllers on PC, right? Which which emulator do I use? What do I even use to play Basket Trio on PC? You know what I'm saying? So your boy up top then, da 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 da, you know what I'm saying? Came through with the video, you know what I'm saying? To bless you guys. So without further ado, let's get right into it, man. All right, so first emulator I got on the screen right here is BlueStacks. I will go ahead, you know what I'm saying, and link um, the emulator for you guys, um, the website for you guys, so you can go ahead and download the emulators, you know what I'm saying? So the first one we got on the screen here is BlueStacks. This is specifically BlueStacks 5 64-bit Nougat. Now, this thing is kind of unstable. It crashes a lot. Um, it's not as... It's not as close to home as other emulators that I use. So, you know, be on, take this one with a little bit of grain of salt. It might crash in the process of me showing you guys how to do this. But, uh, yeah, I got both controllers here just to give you guys an example. This is an Xbox X controller. I got a PS5 controller as well. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to the guys for the support. But, uh, yeah. I mainly play these games with the PS5 controller so let me plug in the PS5 controller and let's go right into it so once you get BlueStacks 5 downloaded there's multiple ways to go about this but the best way to do it is to go into your uh, controls right go into your controls go into control settings right and before you even do any of this what you want to do is make sure you go to the game settings there's like three slashes up top here right there's three slashes up top um you go to your settings in blue stacks and you make sure that your gamepad allow games direct access to your gamepad because um black basket trio actually has something called um what is it google play and apple as well you know they have default controls that you could set up you know to play the game right and you don't want those default controls interfering so what you want to do with it the uh, emulator is still going to pick up your your controller you're still going to be able to map your settings so what you want to do is you want to go into your controls right and uh, just because the keys for the emulators controls are smaller what you want to do is make everything smaller make everything smaller make everything smaller right um, and then to make the game full screen what you want to do is press f11 right but before you press f oh you see what I'm saying it crashed but I have a specific layout that I have set for this um, when I go ahead and map it uh, you could go ahead and you know copy exactly what I'm doing, but I have an exact layout for how I've done this. I've done this pretty much for the last uh, five, four, or five years that I've been doing um, three, three times three games. You know what I'm saying? So I've been using these controls pretty much since Dunk Nation. You know what I'm saying? This is how I've done all my controls. This is how I've done my key mapping. Um, so what you guys want to do now that you have this stuff set up is you want to make sure that you start, you know, getting those controls in. And as you see right here, I don't know if you can see at the top. Let me see. Yeah, it says gamepad. You see keyboard and mouse on the left side and gamepad on the right side. So what you want to do is they already have some of these little dots. If they don't have the dots, all you got to do is click on the screen and, you know, just put the key in, right? All you got to do is that click on the screen, put the key in, right? So they already have some keys there for you guys to go ahead and use. Just go ahead and use the keys. You know what I'm saying? Just be as efficient as possible. Put the keys in. Um, I like to leave some keys here as well because I like to map my celebrations as well. I map my celebrations um, 
and I map, but I might save the celebrations mapping for a year. So this one, for this one, I use left trigger. So this trigger right here on the far left side, and then this one, you know what I'm saying, X button for the diving, and then for the dashing, I use the triangle button. And then for drive, I use the O button. So this is uh, from from the left side to the right side, left trigger on Xbox, uh, A, Y, B, and then X on, con on Xbox. So just so you guys can follow along. And then for this little directional thingy over here, what you want to do is you want to drag the D-pad over from over on that side. So you drag over the D-pad. It says D-pad. Um, you can't see it, but it's going to say D-pad on the right side. What you want to do is, let me move my, my thingy. What you want to do is you want to drag the D-pad over to the directional, right? And that's how you're going to map your left stick. I already have the left stick um, over on there. So I'm going to remove this one. I just wanted you guys to see so boom boom put that back and then there's a little gear wheel you can't see it. it's so so small what you want to do is change it it says d-pad currently what you want to do is change it to left stick and as you can see it, it'll change into this little circular into this little circular symbol and that's your directional right there um, this emulator I'm not too fond of it you know if you guys want to go ahead and use it you can um, everything is mapped as you can see now let me go into a solo training this is also another way that you can map your keys I just go into block and just to give you guys an example so as you can see the keys are mapped boom keys are mapped right keys are mapped everything is working and I tell you I'll plug in this is the PS5 controller I plug in the Xbox X controller and it will work uh, just the same so the Xbox X controller oh, gamepad connected and it will work just the same right all right so here goes my most trusted emulator right here you know what i'm saying i 100 percent recommend this emulator to you guys if you want to use blue stacks you can just know the ps5 controller has some noticeable delay um with blue stacks and you know what i'm saying it's the complete opposite the ps5 controller <laughs> has no noticeable delay on ld player so um, there is noticeable delay on the Xbox controller on LD player though, so it's just vice versa. So uh, Xbox controller for blue stacks and uh, PS5 controller for LD player. So just so you guys, you know what I'm saying, have a little bit of more comfortability, you know, accessibility uh, when you're using the uh, emulators. So uh, the connection process is pretty much the same with this emulator so let me move this over um you just hit the gamepad key and you go to your controls and you want to put in the controls um pretty much the same as you see them or how you sort them on uh with the blue stacks one so all you have to do go into your controls you know hit pull up the little joystick you see look there's a little joystick symbol over here not a joystick but a little controller symbol over here and there's one up here as well but um that's just this just just to say it's connected but this is the one you want to use right here you hit it and it just pulls up this little menu right here for you to use as you can see everything is pretty simple everything is pretty slim uh pretty plain for you i'm trying to fix this right now everything is pretty plain I have kind of this OCD problem. If if something is not in order, like I'm gonna notice. And this thing was not in order just now, so I had to fix it. But yeah, um, everything is pretty much the same, you know, as with uh, Blue Stacks, right? So you want to apply the same control scheme as with Blue Stacks. The only thing is on this player right here, I have my celebrations mapped. Um, 
so in order to map your celebrations what you want to do is you want to go into a live match right a solo match training ground and you go into an ai match and you just want to apply you know your key your celebrations however you want you could use the d-pad you could use buttons whatever you want you could overlap the buttons just get creative with it you know put your celebrations in um but let me go ahead and show you guys how i have my celebrations uh they show up on the screen exactly how i have them shown to you so this is the rt for um the group celebration um up for the up celebration or the big celebration like you guys will see it you could you could go in here and it's literally the same as everything in here so this is up right um look look at it so you see how that one is up click it so that one is up so it'll be this one right here down left right so it's in that exact same order you know i have my uh this is the right joystick this is the left joystick if you guys are paying attention so this is the left stick right stick you know all of that good stuff you don't need right stick on basket trio though all you need is the left stick um and you could just press on the screen to get the buttons really and truly you could also use this you could just put a you could just put a key in right and you could you could go ahead and just put it over there or you could just grab it from over here however you guys want to do it um it's very simple very easy if you guys have any questions just let me know uh but uh yeah that's pretty much it with the key mapping celebration mapping group celebrations all that good stuff um even for other games it doesn't have to be basket trio it could be other games so uh yeah hopefully this video helped you guys you know what i'm saying more videos on the way more streams on the way i stream pretty much every single day you know what i'm saying so if you guys want to uh just tap in every stream is educational every stream is you know what i'm saying fun good vibes all of that good stuff if you guys want to tap into the streams you guys can it's your boy pro jamaica and i'm up out of here man peace